for all you slaves out there that thought this was staged, it wasn't real, it was it was fake, and Donald Trump looking for uh, views and whatever whatever y'all might say. Tell this man family right here. Tell this man family that story. The same story y'all sitting out here shooting out your mouth with that fake rhetoric. This man lost his life at the goddamn mega rally. But yet y'all doing videos saying that the shit was staged and it was fake. How is it fake that this man lost his life? Standing on what he believed. And his family, protecting his family. And you ignorant people out here doing videos saying it was staged, it was fake, and ah, y'all people are disgusting. Let's get into this video. ...of who Corey Comparator was. The retired firefighter from Buffalo Township died protecting his wife and daughter from the bullets at Saturday's Trump rally. Our Tom Garris is live now, and Tom, people near and far, they just want to do something for this man's family. Yeah, Shannon, that's right. And his story of heroism, shielding his family from the gunfire, resonating with so many folks tonight. We spoke with the uh, local organizer of an online fundraiser for the family who says the response has far exceeded expectations. You got this. It's a little grippy. It's fine. Get those shoulders up and back, though. Jason Bubb started his gym a few years back to help people. And now the rest of the nation is joining in. Everyone in this country is kind of putting their, putting their two cents in. His GoFundMe started for Allison Comparator and her family has brought in $1 million. Her father, Corey, was shot and killed at the Donald Trump rally in Butler this weekend. He's being hailed a hero for shielding his family right, from the man. gunfire. Salute. I hope he's remembered as the hero he was, the father that he was, the... Um, the husband that he was it's just such an impact to this small area but now that the world knows about this this is something that's great bub tells me allison has been a strong member of the gym since day one i see her every week here uh and that's really who i did it for uh was was her allison she's She's an awesome client of mine. Bub says he met Corey years ago. They both worked out at another local gym. Corey had been on the powerlifting team there. Tonight, the retired firefighter who died protecting others also remembered for being a loving dad. You can see how much he cared about those those girls of his, his wife and his two daughters. And th those girls just mean the world to him. Bub says he... Now tell that to his family and friends that that shit was staged for all you hypocrite and slaves. Like I said, we got black slaves and we got white slaves. Tell that to his family and friends that that shit was staged, you fucking heathens. Says he doesn't want any credit for this. He just wants the family to know that he's here for them. We'll have a link to that GoFundMe on our website, WTAE.com. For now, reporting live in Terenum, Tom Garris, Pittsburgh's Action News 4. Uh -huh.